Welcome back, my friends. My name is Eric. This is Mellow7 Gaming, and we are playing MechWarrior 5. We are back with the Corvus Conspiracy, and uh, we'll see how it goes. All right, now that I got that off, it is too warm for that. It was about 95 degrees today here. I tried to record a little bit earlier today, but, um, man, nobody has air conditioning where I live because it doesn't get it doesn't get hot except for a week or two out of the year. This just happens to be um, day one of that week. So, um, temperature outside's dropped about 20 degrees, but it hasn't quite dropped that in the garage at the moment. So, uh, a little bit warm, but we got to get some episodes recorded if we're going to record them because if I don't do it now, I'll have to do it during the day when it's really hot. Now, my 3D printed uh, mask that I did, uh, I have worked on a second version, and this one um, has a few changes to the nose and some stuff that doesn't matter as well as how it's put together. But I did a little uh, little carbon fiber vinyl cutout. I got a new Cricut uh, kind of hobby cutter thingy ma bobber CNC thing. So we did that. I thought it was pretty cool. So that's my crafting going as far as Mech Warrior goes. So let's go ahead and see how this is going to go. Now, um, I'm not, I, I started a, uh, a private save just so I could continue to play some Mech Warrior when I wasn't recording for you guys, so I don't get too far ahead. Um, I'm trying to record kind of one week at a time and not record until kind of the next weekend, so at least I have all the, all the comments in before I go forward. Uh, and I'm not going to lie, the private save went pretty bad. I got my butt kicked pretty much over and over and over again. As rough as this one has been a couple times, I've actually done a little bit better on this one than I did in that one. The mission where you have to kill the spider at the end, right? You go in, you destroy the bandit base, and then the, oh my god, they've got a spider. And you chase him around. I killed him, turned around to walk back to the leopard, and uh, my heat was about 106, and I had an ammo cook-off, and it killed me. All of the bad guys were dead. And boom, you see the explosion there. I had it in third person. And, uh... Ammo explosion dead. So, um, yeah, so it hasn't gone so well. Uh, I'm not actually sure, to be honest, where we are here. So let's go ahead and hit tab. Uh, we've got some stuff that is being worked on, it looks like. We've got a Locust and a Javelin 10A as our backup. That's right, we had that. Let's go ahead and verify that we have rolls that we want. Um, whoops, that's not what I'm looking for. Um, although we can paint that guy. I did come up with a what I call my Corvus Dark, so dark blue and, and, and black. A little bit of gray in there to kind of tie back into our kind of our raven theme there. Um, does this guy need to be painted too? I thought I'd gone through and did all these, but I apparently just did the ones that were uh, in the hangar hand, or in the hangar bay. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at our loadout really fast. Um, this guy probably should just be what? Scout? Is that what we have it set to? Scout roll. Perfect. That will work just fine. Um, some extra engines in there. That's good to know. We might have to sell those at some point. We got a little bit of money. Uh, this guy we want to have listed as a missile boat. Yep, perfect. Um, assassin. Um, this guy doesn't really have much going for him, period. We can't mess with it till he's healed, but I'm kind of thinking we might say scout roll on him too, because he's just got so little, so little to do. I mean, with the medium laser, the two, we'd like him to use his speed and more or less stay out of the way. Um, Jenner. Um, kind of that striker skirmisher role, probably. Centurion's our brawler, I think, and Javelin's probably also that kind of skirmisher role. So we'll kind of have to verify that we have roles set the way we want them to be set. Uh, I'm not sure where we are in the galaxy at the moment. Uh, we're at Princeton. We don't have any more things to do there. We do have a demolition and a war zone contract here, though. Um, looks like uh, competing there, what, Rebels versus Davian? And then we were thinking about maybe coming down here. Um, this is what? Recommended level four, recommended three. We're four now. Um, that's an assassination and a raid. Again, oh, they're both for Davian, though. Let's do those. Let's hop up there, and then we'll hop, maybe go via this place here, and then down. Um, how do we move them? We can scroll, I guess I, there we go, right click. Remembering how we move stuff. Uh, we've got some hero mechs and stuff down there. I don't remember if we looked at those last time or not, but. I think we go here. I like the assassination. I like the raid. Let's uh, let's hop on that. That should get our uh, our stuff healed up. While we go, see two of them done. Oh, let me turn down the volume a little bit. Just watching some mini war gaming. Watching a ba battle report earlier today. Side the volume up a little bit. Got to hear all the dice rolls, right? Um, all right, is that everybody fixed? I saw two rollover, yeah, so everybody's fixed. Let's go ahead and make sure I got rolls set the way I want. Um, scout roll, perfect. I wish in here you could just kind of click next, 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 and go through all of your mechs, rather than have to back out and click somebody else. I, I know it's a small thing, um, but you know, it's it's three or four extra clicks that are kind of needless. There should just be a next mech, last mech thing. Um, skirmisher roll, perfect. 
Um, we want this to be, I think, brawler roll. Um, brawler, yep, good. And one more skirmisher, I'm thinking. All right, so I think everything's good as far as that goes. Um, everybody, I don't have any weird issues with anybody other than that we're in the conflict zone and it's expensive. Yeah, okay, I don't see any errors there. So we're gonna take a look at contracts. Uh, do we have pilots? Uh, yeah, we got four pilots. Okay, so we're okay there. Contracts. So we've got, this one's an 11, this one's a 12. May as well just start with the 11. Uh, we've got six, so... Um... I think y'all were saying that, that it's che it's reasonably cheap to buy mechs in this one, to get parts and stuff. So let's go ahead and just go for the money. Because if we buy it ourselves, we have a lot more control over what we get. If we take salvage, then we just kind of have to accept what they give us. You know, uh, we're 10 over. Um, well, the assassin's the, the obvious one to drop. So let's go um, regular Jenner here. And then back here, we'll throw in the javelin. I think that will work. Um, yeah, we don't really have anybody other than Freeman that's going to get much out of missiles anyway. So let's just kind of leave him where he is with lasers and running around. I think that will be fine. So we're exactly at 145. Um, do we have... I hope we've got the ammo sorted on that thing. I think we do. I, I vaguely remember actually figuring it out. Um inset so if you haven't played this before make sure your ammo matches your gun <laughs> now we salvaged it you know it's not like we had huge choice but still i'm going to be a different topic i need to get a lavalier mic so i have a mic to put inside the masks <clears throat> for when i do kind of the costume stuff Reactor because I think for this online. and the warhammer stuff both Sensors um online. there'll be a fair amount of that Weapons in fact i've got online two others on All the wall at the anonymous. moment <laughs> and I need to get a gas mask if I'm going to properly do Warhammer uh, stuff. Uh, as well as anti-pandemic. Um, alright. Let's see, can I squeeze past here? Maybe? Maybe? Oh, he's going to fly up. There we go. Now we can. Alright. I guess we could have walked all the way around, but I think this will be fine. Uh, and this is the assassination one, right? Okay. So I think we try to maybe... I think once we get around this hill, we'll kind of hug it to the right there to keep our distance from the other two kind of far westerly. Uh, those two sites, so hopefully we don't, we don't pull everything right away. In case there are more guys there, we just want to get that one, if that's possible. And uh, if it means that... Eh, we'll walk around this guy's house. Say if it means this guy loses his house, so he probably still is. Somebody's gonna run over him. Let's stop it and take a look. Looks so good. Look, he's got. I actually was watching a thing on these little egg-shaped tiny houses that are about that size. Just yesterday, he's got himself one of the Rivian electric trucks. <laughs> he's standing on the helicopter pad. There we go. It's funny with the with the. Uh, size whatever rescaler um you know it really brings kind of some of the mechs that were bigger back down to like a normal size and you really appreciate some of the details a little bit more i think uh i guess there's nobody there hopefully they'll take care of the dude to the right oh, i lost the target they did all right so i'm gonna go up here Really? Yeah, I mean, I like this. We're in the trees here shooting like this. I really like the new scale. I think this makes so much more sense. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, we got more coming over the hill, though. Is he going to come through there? Yeah, I like this. I like this. the views of being in the stuff rather than towering over it. I think it makes uh, he makes it just all better. Oh, we got him with the missiles. Nice. We got one more dude up here. Uh, oh, J. Edgar. Oh, we'll never kill him. 
Oh, never mind. Somebody got him. Nice. I see some more targets over there. I'm going to hope that they're just um, turrets that we can walk away from. Oh, they're not going to walk away. They're going to kill it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Final little explosion there was kind of cool. Is it snowing? A little bit of snow in the air. Okay. Kind of that crisp fall day. You get just some of those little flurries. It's either that or maybe ash. I'm not sure what it's supposed to be. Of course, the problem here is if we go right up the middle, we're going to trigger it. We got both of them there. We got two of them there. I don't know if that's both of them. I'm going to try to get us over here. And we'll walk around and, and engage this way. Again, trying to not pop the other location if we can avoid it. The only problem is everybody else... Tank is just not going. All right. I'm going to kind of let my rest of my team get in here. Take up some of these little harassers, as they legitimately are. And let's see if we can get rid of this dude's arm. First of all, get a lock. We got a shot, the AC-10 I missed on. Uh, uh, I've... For a minute there, I couldn't control anything. Come on, show me the other arm. Did we get his arm? No, no, not yet. He's got the large laser. There we go. There we go. Arms down. All right, now let's um, let's put a shot into his back because we could. It's our heat. Heat's fine. Where's the other dude? Uh, he still has all his arms. Uh, I'm gonna turn back on. Completely with that. I mean, it worked. It went into the back. Come on, buddy. Give me the back again. Out of my way. There we go. There we go. Uh, I think I just saw another dropship land back there. Oh, we got a lot of dudes running around here. How is he still up? We'll just stay on the guns here until he goes down. All right, we can go. Uh, I think we do so. Now let's get you all home. I'm going to put everybody on him. How are we doing? We're in good shape, actually. I'm going to go after this LRM carrier, because my god. We're going to let them skirmish with the spider, because we don't care. And I'm just going to bail. I'm just going to go. There's no reason to take more damage. Everything that we needed to kill is dead. We went for money rather than salvage. Although that blackjack would be pretty good. I would not mind that blackjack at all. I just had a panic attack on uh, uh, audio there. But it's going. <laughs> oh, computer's chugging a little bit. Hey, there's that blackjack, actually. I'm going to take it. Um, I guess that's CT? I think that's CT. So we might need an engine for it, but that's okay. Yeah, my computer is struggling a little bit here. The heat today was just was just bad, and it's cooled down some, but... Um, 119.63. It's only 43 there. Um, nobody leveled... Well, he might ha uh No, I think he was just started on that level. Um, he almost finished off a couple things. Yeah, we did okay. Everybody came out of this in pretty good shape. 
Let's check how bad, how badly beat up that, uh, I think it's going to need an engine. Has all the guns. I mean, that's something. Um, and we do have some spare engines. We might even have a 180. We do. Let's see if we were to repair all. I don't think I want to do it here because cost, um, but it's fixable. It's completely fixable. A couple heat sinks. Um, I'm going to revert. Um, and we're going to wait because I don't want to pay for it. But yeah, I mean, we set it down, but the engine didn't explode. Everything is, and that might be because of our settings. I'm not sure. Oh, we took the head out. Oh, look, we didn't finish off the CT. Look, it's still got some structure and some, some cooling and stuff. Um, in fact, it's still got 15 armor left. We actually got a headshot in there somewhere. Somebody did. That explains it. All right, that's perfect. That's awesome. Oh, wait, so our max, though. Whoops, we need to fix our stuff, though. Um, let's repair. Start. Repair. Yeah, instead of the javelins, we could run assassin and locust actually next time and see how that goes. Uh, I think that'll balance back out again. Uh, we might get a couple more tons here out of that. Uh, 160, actually, yeah, it is. It went from 145 to 160. So uh, I'm going to go ahead. Let's wait for everything to get fixed. It's only four days. There we go. Now contracts. All right. So one, two, three. One, two, three. Two of everything. I think that'll work. Got a little bit of money. Three million up there. Uh, and we will take out this javelin. And we'll put in the assassin. There we go. So scout, skirmish, skirmish, brawler. I think that'll work. And we're going really quickly today, even with my long intro and... Because I just hit record, got my little clap checked for audio syncing and stuff like that. And had to put on the gear and take off the gear. We're still... We've only been had the camera rolling for 21 minutes. All right, I'm going to do this. I lied. Um, do you want to go north? I just want to get around. Get out of my way. There you go. Thank you. We're going to roll right up here. Um, don't know. Dead. I haven't decided if I want to go up. If we go up up the ramp, destroy there, then we turn and go north from the center there and wrap back around to the left to get the other two. I think that will work. So what am I looking for on there? Okay, so it's just past this little gully. Whoops, as I run into stuff. Whoops. Trying to get my screens right there. Yeah, we're just seeing it there on the... Essentially, oh, essentially we just want to do a right, right here. Destroy. These harassers at least aren't too bad. Let's move so we don't take too many. I don't actually know if we can see that dude in the rocks there. There we go. Now I'm headed up. They're already on it. What do we got up there? Another uh, harasser with LRM-10. See a helicopter up there. They got him. All right, come on, guys, follow me. Where's our? Why is he still down there? Is it the Jenner? It is. Um. F two, F three. Is he moving? Oh, wait, he's moving. All right, good. He got stuck on something, but uh, figured it out. So let's get in here and destroy this stuff out. All right. Uh, I'll give him a F1, F2 again. Get everybody following me. And let's see about taking out these satellite uplinks. 
I'll let them take the second shot at him. Nice. Enemy destroyed. Good job. Good job. All right, it's down. Was oh, it just these? Not really sure. We'll just run into stuff. That's one less target. All right, so now we should be able to go to the north. Wrap down that next ramp. I don't have north pointed north all the time anymore. So okay, we'll just sneak out here. Looks like there's a big arrow, whatever, dealy bobber up there. Oh, there's a mech there. Oh. Can I smash through walls? No, not big enough. What is it? A panther. I wouldn't mind a panther. Missed him. Missed them all. Let me get some missiles on them. These things will mess you up if you let them sit up there. Alright. Hey, welcome to the fight. Nice of you to join us. AC5 and that scorpion. All right, now let's take care of the mech. Oh, he's already almost CT'd. I'm just going to finish him. All right, well, as long as we're down here, we may as well wrap down here and then hang a right. Okay. We've got everybody on us. Got shot in the back a little bit. It's okay. Everybody here can catch up to me. Oh, I saw him 20. Yeah, we want him dead. Uh, I don't think I killed him. Nope, I didn't. Let's try to keep missiles on him. Let's go back to our heat vision. There we go. All right, one more thing to get. I think we'll probably stay in this view. It's, I hate not actually being able to see where lasers and stuff are going, but um, can we walk over that? Can we walk between that? Yeah. Another SRM-20. Okay. Got a helicopter up there. Lost my target, interestingly enough. You wouldn't think something that I never actually lost physical sight of and can't move. Scratch that target off the list. I would be able to lose my link of. Uh, where are we going? Where are we going? Just back south. Okay. Easy enough. Yeah, we're just gonna. They got it? Alright. Now, in theory, I'm running a uh, mod now that will let you trigger um, kind of things to happen with your guys, right? So, uh, in theory, they're all down. Yeah. In theory, we could send them up there, and I haven't. It doesn't appear to work for me, to be honest. Um, F1, F3. So in theory, now they can run up and trigger the mission ending or or kick off the war zone or whatever else it may be, right? So if we say it's 350, let's go ahead and try to get to th three F1, F3. Now, I played with it a little bit in my private save, and it didn't seem to actually do anything, and it doesn't appear to be working here either. So it may just not work, um, but it is on. Where's he going? He is jumping. I like that. I did see a little red over there for a second. Did he jump over to get him? Welcome back. 
Yeah, no, it didn't trigger it off. It's supposed to. Oh. I need to bring the chair back up a little bit. If I cut my face off mostly, trying to get the helmet in frame was a... Uh, I had to lower the chair. <laughs> and there's the panther. I'm going to take it. I think the panther is great. I'm going to take... Um, what do we have the um i'm gonna take another one of these i mean i'm just looking at what we have and what we don't have um and i'm gonna take another heat sink because when you need heat sinks a lot of times you need lots of heat sinks um so we'll go for that he only took 11 damage while he was stuck on the rock or whatever happened to him for so long assassin almost lost arm but still did a whopping 59 damage although the general only did 76 it was just me and horton essentially doing all the work that mission um which is fine. That's fine. Okay, so there's no reason to do the repair here. Oh, I got mech and cold storage. Uh, I don't think that matters. I mean, we can go ahead and move them over. Um, there we go. Uh, and we do see that there is locusts on the on the map. Um, should we look to see, whoops, let's, should we see if there's anything here that interests us as far as equipment goes? Not really seeing anything. Nope, I think we're okay. So let's go star map. And uh, off to Kolya. Yeah? Or, or da Damvang. I think we go to Damvang, because that sounds cooler. Or we could go to here. There's a rare mech. Um, how many jumps is it? No, nah, it's too many jumps. We'll go to Damvang. We just want to go get repaired and uh, see if there's anything else we want to buy. I mean, we've got... I can't believe there's much of that panther. That's going to need an engine, right? We had to have CT'd that. I guess we should look at it before we start figuring out what we're buying and selling. Um, no. Headshot again. Somebody took off his head. I mean, it sure looks that way. Let's go edit loadout. Yep. Head's gone. Zero, zero. Still has eight armor there. So, yeah. Both of them were headshots. That's pretty cool. Uh completely unintentional. I don't think I got them because I don't think I heard a nice shot commander or whatever, you know, you normally get when you do it, so it must have been them. Um, either way, that means the repair on them is quite a bit better. Um, I think, honestly, with these two here, that makes the assassin expendable because the assassin's, frankly, hot garbage. Um, so I think we can probably sell it. Uh, might just strip it and sell it. And we probably sell the locust too. That would still leave us with, well, with six mechs. Um, I don't mind the Locust, actually, to be honest. Two medium lasers and the two machine guns is still a fair amount of firepower. So it's not terrible to keep. Let's see if they have anything on the market that interests us. Um, an assassin. Another... Oh. This I wouldn't mind having. I Actually, this is my favorite of the Javelins. So we could go with the 10, the 10N, the Super Javi, um, with the two SRM6s. Now, what we do for armor, so what, it's got about 128 normally. Ah, it's about the same. Um, what do we have on ours? Um, 176, so we might be able to do a little bit of work with that. So what if we sell... I'm kind of thinking this is the one to sell, actually. What if we sell the Assassin and the 10A, and we buy the 10N... And that leaves us seven mechs, so we have some extras for, we could do some multi-mission, right? Um, you know, maybe we could even do some of the, you know, the three mission ones where we can repair in the middle. I think that's the way to go. Okay, so do we have anything on this that we care about? Um, whoops. Battle mechs, edit. Is there anything we need to strip off it that's, that's good? Um, I mean, we do have the SRMs. I don't really see anything there. I mean, we could take the engine out if we wanted. I don't know that we need it for anything. And we do have some spare motors already. Um, right now, if we were to sell it, uh, we get 1.9 mil. I think we take the money. I mean, it is, for whatever reason, <laughs> our most expensive mech. And I don't really know why, um, but I'm gonna sell it. So that one's gone. And then I want to sell the 10A. Yeah, 
Let's sell that, and then let's go back to market, and let's buy that 10N. And now let's go see what we need to do to fix everything. Uh, did they put it into cold storage? No, it's right here. Okay. So we'll start with him. Uh, repair all. Uh, we need some heat sinks and some ammo. That we have. Uh, one, two, ammo. I'm going to take off two jump jets. Move the ammo down to the legs for both of these. And we need an SRM. Do we have an SRM-6? We do not. Probably should have kept the four off of the um, other guy. But can we come here and see what they've got? Uh, a four... Oh, okay, it's guided or unguided. They all say guided or unguided. What's the... Okay. SRM-4 plus versus SRM-4. Oh, it's got Artemis. Okay, so they're Artemis. We might have to do a little bit of a run to see if we can come up with... Um... Delta Dart with Artemis. Okay. Doombud. That's just such a good name. Uh, we might have to run around a little bit to see if we can come... Oh, there we go. SRM-6. Um, yeah. Let's buy that. And as long as we're here and they have another one, I'm going to buy the spare, just in case we need it for repairs. Um, I think that's probably reasonably a good idea. Um, let's kill that. Oops. And then we'll put it in there. Hmm. Still says we're down three. Are these worth one ton? No, they're half. Oh, where did my ammo go? I thought I drug ammo. Oh, it's a jump jet spot. It won't let me put the ammo there. It's jump jets or nothing. Um. Okay. Okay. Uh, I guess. I guess that's how we do it then. And that leaves us one more ton for some extra armor. So we'll hit max armor, see what it gives us. I think that's okay. That takes us up to 170-something. Um, about, about the same as the others. 183, maybe? 182? I think 182. Um, I think that's okay. Something like that. We've got seven heat sinks there, plus those three heat sinks. Okay. Let's start the work. 66,000. Uh, oh, let's paint him. It's the important bit. There we go. Had to click back and forth a little bit. That's fine. All right. Blackjack. He did not know when to fold them, clearly. Um, and we got to click on those specifically to get them repaired. Um, two large lasers, two medium lasers, a bunch of heat sinks, some jump jets. Uh, armor's 240, which for us is okay. It, it's down a little bit, but it's not huge. Um, I'm kind of wondering if maybe we'd get rid of one jump? Well, I hate doing just one. Are these weigh one or do they weigh two? They're, they're still the half ton. Um, we could get rid of a heat sink. I don't know. This thing's going to build up heat. I think we go with it. And if we see, find that we're... That's why. Only 18. Um, if we find he's getting beat up really bad regularly, then we can see about adding a little bit more. I'm going to... I know it's not a lot, but I like a little bit on the back. Um, we'll give it a go. So let's start that. There's not much going on there. And then what do we have on the Panther? Oops. Paint. Gotta handle the good stuff. There we go. May as well paint him first. <clears throat> And we go back and change the patterns. I just set the, the colors up. I think it's just default with the colors. And one heat sink. And he's got 208 armor. And his armor's close to max. Again, he doesn't have a lot in the head, which is how we got it with that headshot. Um, but otherwise, I don't really see a whole lot we need to change. 
Um, again, we can't put any ammo in the legs because jump jets are there. Um, it's got the P the Lord's Light PPC. Um, does he have an SRM? He's got the SRM-4 in there. Uh, with one ton of ammo. Okay. I think that'll be okay. I think we live with that. Uh, he's only got five integrated heat sinks in that thing. It's only a 140. Um, so that one weighs five tons, but then you have to put in five more heat sinks. So if we were to go up to say like a 180, that's seven tons, but in theory, we should be able to put two more heat sinks in it, right? And therefore get our weight back? Is it really gonna work that way for me? I don't think so, let's find out. If we take this, can we take it out? Can I drop 180 on it? Oh, I had to right click it. Now if we drop this in here, It took away all our heat sinks when we did that. So now we should be able to put three heat sinks back in. I'm, I'm not gonna put them in here with the armor. If we lose this, I don't wanna lose all my heat sinks too. Um, and vice versa. Um, if we lose this, we're out the heat, we're out the PPC anyway, and we don't need the heat sinks. Um, so yeah, I think we can just kind of stack them back in there. So before we had five plus five, I think, we probably had more. Okay, so our cooling is down 0 0.2 if we do this. I think that's fine. Um, and we're faster. So our speed is up 18. We've still got the jump jets. I think we'll do that. Since we had the engine, I think that makes sense. So that's that. Um, we've got to be up to 30 minutes at this point, though. So we're going to call this one here. Um, let's check barracks. One more thing before we go. Um, let's see, we've got 20 and 24. Is there anybody better Pull here? Down, Commander. I've trained no. This. Well, 23, Lieutenant Gustafson. Ready for action. See, his, his is... Down, when I first I've started designing this. mine, this is kind of what I was looking at. And we're pretty close. He's got these bumps, and his is not, his is not asymmetrical. Mine ended up looking like uh, Johnny Five more than anything else. Johnny Five is alive. Um, which I can't unsee now that it was pointed out. Um, and then I was actually going to do an attachment, right? Because the... The tactical helmets have a, a spot for those types of attachment. Uh, but then when I went looking, I could either get really expensive ones for the two, or I get affordable ones that just do one monocle type of uh, night vision, low light. And so I decided not to, although I did get a... Um... <sighs> Is it kicking around up here? I did get a GoPro mount to go up there. So that could go on, and then I could mount a visor that way. And I might, where's the, so in theory, you could do something like that, right? And then it could rotate up and down. So I just have to figure out like, what type of mount I wanna put on the back or in the front or however we wanna do it um, to attach to it. And I do have a bunch of random GoPro stuff, so maybe, but this is kind of what I was, this is the one specifically I was looking at. And then there's at least one of them that's wearing the, the half, demon mask uh in there as well so anyway i kind of like the kind of cyberpunk-ish um kind of uh look that they went for on some of these but nobody here we need to buy so we will be back he would be a good missile guy for us actually two of five four 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 twenty three i am i'm gonna hire him if we come up with another missile boat oh we do we have one we just got the uh the the super javi um, he'll be good for that. Anyway, we'll see you guys next time. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Don't forget to subscribe. Cheers.